Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I thought I was done filming for the day and I was like, holy crap, I forgot to film this video that I wanted to be up on Valentine's Day, which isn't that, is Valentine's Day technically the day before Valentine's Day? Or is it just Valentine's Day, but one you celebrate with your girlfriends? I'm not sure, but this video is going up the day before Valentine's Day and it's dedicated to my subscribers. I was actually given this idea by one of my subscribers. She is actually my last giveaway winner, Leah. She's such a loyal subscriber and I really just want to call her my friend because she watches my videos every morning. She always watches them with coffee and she never fails to comment saying she's having coffee and watching my video and honestly it makes my day. And when she suggested this video, I immediately went to Charlotte Holcroft, I believe is her name. She is a British YouTuber with almost 30,000 subscribers. And she made a video called Hyping Up My Subscribers for Christmas. And I was like, oh my gosh, Leah, this is such a great idea. Thank you so, so much. So if she's watching, hey, Leah, I hope you enjoy your coffee. Happy Valentine's Day from me to you. And she did win my Vlogmas giveaway, so that was so so fun and we've been emailing and I was like thank you so much for this video idea so basically what Charlotte did was she asked her subscribers if it was okay to feature them on her YouTube video on her channel and so I did the same thing if you guys missed my post I'm sorry I'll maybe do this video again depending on how the response goes but I just thought it was such a great way to Thank all of my subscribers. I wish I had millions of dollars so I could do giveaways and send you guys makeup all the time, but unfortunately that isn't my reality. So this is the best way I can think of to say thank you, give you guys shout outs, and just hype you up the way you guys hype me up in the comments. You guys make me feel like a million dollars, just like I had said in my post. and. I could never thank you guys enough for subscribing to me and supporting me in your likes and your thumbs ups and your hearts and all of that and the time you guys take to comment and share your stories with me means so much to me. Um, so anyway, I just wanted to thank Charlotte, thank Leah for the idea and I'm going to start off with people that commented on my Instagram post and then I'm going to switch to people that commented on my YouTube post. So the first person is Maddie and Maddie's actually my best friend's little cousin. So I've known her for a long time and Maddie loves makeup. So it's gonna be very obvious when you guys see her pictures. If you take the time to check out her Instagram, she loves Jeffree Star. She does really fun makeup. I believe she's still in theater or has done theater. So. I've seen a lot of her performances. She's a wonderful actress and I wish her nothing but the best. She's gorgeous and does wonderful makeup. I would love for her to start a channel, honestly, or just become hugely Instagram famous because she's stunning. So first person I wanted to give a shout out to was Maddie. The next person that commented was Amira Reviews Things and I was looking at her Instagram and she has some beautiful makeup that she's collected and so pretty. She has a beautiful complexion, beautiful hair, so stunning. And so I just wanted to give her a shout out. It looks like she is getting into project panning and is a makeup and skincare enthusiast, which is what we all are here on the beauty space. So very cool to check out that profile as well. The next person that commented was Jessica Alexandra425. And oh, this is so cute. She knows the way to my heart. She's got this adorable picture where she's got a beautiful eyeshadow look on and a puppy. And it looks like the puppy's name is Willow. And they're adorable. And so, Jessica, you know the way to my heart. I love puppies. Your puppy's adorable. You're adorable. I love her haircut. I love her style. It's very like casual with denim jackets and I love this purple hair. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. So cute. Okay, the next person that commented is Marty's Makeup. Hopefully I said that right. I'm so sorry. So Makeup Lover, unedited makeup looks, which I love. Oh my gosh. I try not to edit my makeup. 
I actually don't know how to, um, so that's a problem, but I, I think it's so important that we make our makeup look like what it does in real life so we don't like set these ridiculously high unattainable standards in beauty. That's just a slight rant here. This girl has amazing eyeshadow looks, beautiful red hair. If you could teach me how to take these close-up pictures of eyeshadow looks, I would be so grateful. Lots of beautiful single eyeshadows. It looks like she bought the colored rain book of shadows. Amazing. Kind of want that. Kind of trying not to be a savage. Looks like she puts together really, really stunning eye looks. Oh my gosh. Amazing, amazing. Instagram and she has a YouTube. So you guys will have to check that out. Next we have Coco Lely. I'm sorry if I butchered that. Renee, is that how you say it? I get so tongue tied. I'm so sorry. Um, I think it's Renee. Stunning. Oh my gosh. Look at that hair. <gasps> and she has the most beautiful complexion ever. Also looks like she got refer brushes. I am so jelly. Did you get the PR bundle for Melt Amor Eterno? Because that makes me very jelly. She's so stunning. Beautiful, beautiful eyes. Beautiful hair. Oh my goodness. You guys are all gorgeous. This is crazy that all of you took the time to comment on this post of mine. Thank you so much. Okay, next is Paige.kb and she, I'm assuming she found me because I'm Sri Lankan because it looks like her husband is Sri Lankan and adorable, absolutely adorable, gorgeous long hair and they just make the cutest couple. Looks like she's really into travel and uh, I'm so jelly because me and my husband still haven't been to Sri Lanka yet so that's like one of our goals of our life hopefully and it also looks like she had a beautiful traditional Sri Lankan wedding so I have to post that picture so you guys can see what one of the more traditional weddings look like and those outfits guys they are no joke so very very cool okay the next person I want to hype up is Miss Bennett makeup and she's a makeup lover and a youtuber you guys, how do these people not have more followers? This is crazy. She's got 93 followers on Instagram and she has beautiful, beautiful eyeshadow looks, beautiful combinations of colors, such stunning makeup looks. Oh my gosh. This is awesome, Miss Bennett makeup. I should call you Anna because that's what it says your name is. So very, very cool. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel means the world to me. Next I have Juliet and she says, no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Story of my life. Love my cats, cooking, and makeup. Yeah, that's that's about summarizes everything that I'll, oh, kitty. Oh, she's got a cute video of her cat in a, in a grocery bag that I'm watching like a nerd right now. Oh, so cute. My husband loses his mind every time he sees cats. You guys send me cat photos and I always show my husband cats. Right, okay, now I remember. She's got the bangles. The really, oh God. I'm so sorry I'm talking about your cats, Juliet, but they are so adorable, as are you. But these two kitties are so gorgeous. Like, look at their markings. <gasps> so cute, so cute. And... Lots of gorgeous makeup looks and cats. I mean, it's like the perfect recipe for me. Next is, oh, I'm gonna butcher this. Ara, Ara, okay, Arana? I'm so sorry if I'm butchering this. I remember her, I remember talking to her. She is from Sweden. I think she found me through Angelica. Look at this cool blue hair, are you kidding me? I want blue hair, give me the blue hair. Oh, and then she, so she does different hair colors. I love that. Super jelly. And it looks like she's got, oh, I love this picture. It's so beautiful. It reminds me of Frida Kahlo. Is that how you say it, Frida Kahlo? I think that's how you say it. Beautiful, so stunning. I don't know what the average 40 year old looks like, but she looks like she is 25, easily. Oh my gosh, gorgeous. Okay, next we have, I don't know if Sid really wanted me to give her a shout out or not, but she commented that this was a great idea. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna shout her out because she's amazing. 
Um, she is a college student from Michigan and we actually collabed over Christmas over Vlogmas and I just love Sid. She is so sweet and like practical and kind and she is on this like low by journey and honestly inspires me all the time. Like um, I'm sure she's much younger than me but I still think she is so inspirational as far as her eyeshadow looks. I love how she plays with color. I love how she's trying to curate her eyeshadow palette collection. All really important things that we can learn from others in the beauty community. So I love Sid so much. She is one of my favorites. I love watching her videos. They're always so casual and short and easy going. So love Sid. <laughs> okay, next is April MD 100 and she has the most beautiful flat lays. I think she gets a ton of this stuff sent to her because I'm sure she's got these beautiful flat lays and I need to like hone in on these flat lay skills but stunning pictures and I don't know how she ended up following me but I'm so grateful because she's so talented and oh look at these pictures I'm just like scrolling 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 and I love this picture of her making fun makeup faces um and um thanking everyone for supporting her in 2019 i think that's really really cool okay the last person that commented on my post on instagram is danielle and danielle i met through youtube as well um i know she shares this account with a friend but i haven't really talked to her friend so i think most of the time i'm just talking to danielle she is not afraid to play with color always doing really colorful fun looks and I know she had kind of a rough year last year and I'm so happy that she's back on YouTube and you know focusing on herself and all kinds of good things are coming her way I think and yeah I'm just so excited to see more from her in 2020. Okay so the person that gave me this awesome idea was Leah like I had mentioned and I believe Leah works in Arizona. Leah loves makeup oh my gosh and she is stunning. Look at that hair. That's the same thing Charlotte said about her. Char she was in Charlotte's video too and ah, uh, it's so beautiful and it's so curly and look, I have all that volume. I really do, Leah, but I do not have the skills to make my hair look that good. So if you could just come visit me and help me out. Okay, next girl I love so much, Sarah. She comments on my videos all the time and She's just great. I mean, look at her. She's got cats and she loves makeup and that's the perfect combination. She's always asking me like really interesting questions in my comment section that actually like make me think a little before I answer. So I really appreciate that from her. She seems like a totally genuine person and so glad that we found each other on the internet. Like that's so cool. Okay, there are some people that commented on my YouTube posts that actually don't follow me on Instagram. So I'm not gonna shout them out because I don't want this video to be a hundred years long. So I am sorry, but I just kind of want to keep it to people that I recognize in my comments and things like that. So the next person I want to give a huge shout out to is Melissa. She always comments such great like informative things. Makes me think Look at all these cat memes. I'm living for the cat memes and oh, look at this eye look. It's so beautiful. I love blue and green eyeshadow on you. It's gorgeous. Way to go. Nerdy girl who loves humor, makeup, beauty, and many other things. To see more awkwardness um, and whatnot, check out my YouTube channel. That's awesome. Oh my gosh, she is so sweet. I see her in my comment section all the time and I just love talking to you guys. You don't even know how much you make my day. And if you guys want to see some gorgeous eyeshadow looks on a darker skin tone, you guys should check out Melissa. Okay, guys, so that is it. That is everyone that commented um, that I recognize from my comment section. Thank you so, so much for taking the time to drop a little line. I hope you guys like this video. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. And if you guys think one of your favorite YouTubers should make this video, let them know, send them the link, let them check it out. Especially Charlotte's video, the original video that inspired mine. I'm gonna leave it linked down below. Send it to your favorite YouTuber and maybe they'll be inspired to create something similar like this. I think it's such a wonderful idea because sometimes all you see is like 
negativity and drama and this and that and it's nice to do something like this it's such a great way to give back to your subscribers so I'm so happy that Leah suggested I do this video I hope you guys enjoyed thank you so so much for watching and I will see you in my next video soon bye guys <laughs>